Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of eighth problem from exercise 13.2 from NCRT from surface areas and volumes class 10. A spherical glass vessel has a cylindrical neck 8 cm long, 2 cm in diameter. The diameter of the spherical part is 8.5 cm. By measuring the amount of water it holds, a child finds its volume to be 345 cm cube. Check whether she is correct taking the above as the inside measurements and pi is equal to 3.14. So here the spherical glass vessel has a cylindrical neck. The measurements of this neck are given. Those are height is 8 centimeters. Length of the cylindrical neck that is height is H1 is 8 centimeters. And diameter is also given that is 2 centimeters. Therefore, radius of the cylinder R1 is equal to diameter by 2 that is 2 by 2 that is equal to 1 centimeters. And diameter of the spherical part, this is the spherical part that is given 8.5 centimeters. Therefore, radius of the spherical part R2 is equal to 8.5 by 2, that is 4.25 centimeters. And here the volume is given that is 345 centimeter cube. We have to check whether this volume is correct or not. So, volume of the glass vessel is equal to volume of the cylindrical part plus volume of the spherical part. And volume of the cylinder is pi r square h. So pi r1 square here, r is r1 and h is h1. So pi r1 square h1 h1 plus here spherical volume of the spherical part is 4 thirds pi r2 cube. Here pi is common. So pi into here r1 square h1 plus 4 by 3 into r2 cube. Now substitute the values here. Pi value is given that is 3.14 into R1 is 1 and H1 is 8 and R2 is 4.25. So 1 square into 8 plus 4 by 3 into 4.25 cube. That value, if you calculate this value, then you will get 346.51 centimeter cube. But the volume here is given is 345 centimeter cube. That is not correct. 